Yo, man, how long is Doug gonna be living here? I don't know, man. I kind of want him out. He's always eating all our food, and his sister is so clumsy. Does he really need all those calories for meiosis? Meiosis? You mean mitosis? What's mitosis? Well, Sammy, mitosis is a type of cell division in which one cell divides to produce two new daughter cells that are genetically identical to each other. Somatic cells undergo mitosis to re replace dead cells or grow the body, but provides no genetic variation. Mitosis is divided into four major phases, prophase, metaphase, anaphase, and telophase. Mitosis starts with prophase, where the chromosome starts to condense, the nuclear envelope breaks down, and the mitotic spindle begins to form. After prophase is a step called metaphase. Here, the spindles line up the chromosomes at the equator of the cell, forming the metaphase plate. Plate? Mmm, now I'm hungry. Mmm. Next in anaphase, the sister chromatids separate from each other and are pulled towards opposite ends of the cell. The protein glue that holds the sister chromatids together is broken down, allowing them to separate. Protein? Now I want some chicken. In telophase and cytokinesis, the cell pulls apart and splits into two identical daughter cells. That's what you mean, right? Uh, I remember meiosis being a bit different. Meiosis is associated with the process of sexual reproduction, as it is the process of creating gametes. Gametes, aka sex cells, are haploids, and they are used in the process of fertilization. Your typical gametes are your sperm cells in males and egg cells in females. Gametes? Sally, bring me some beef. Here you go, Doug. I brought you up. Oh no! I dropped it on your foot! Ow! Mitosis? Meiosis is split into two steps. Meiosis 1 and Meiosis 2. And they each also follow the steps of prophase, metaphase, anaphase, and telophase. First, we start with a diploid somatic body cell. In prophase, the cell gets ready for division. In metaphase, all the chromosomes line up. In anaphase, the sister chromatids are pulled to the poles. And in telophase slash cytokinesis, the cell divides into two cells, each with a pair of haploid sister cells. After that, a very similar process occurs in meiosis 2. After meiosis 2 is over, we are left with four genetically different gametes. Which is different from mitosis, which produces two identical daughter cells. Produce? Gross. I just want meat. 